Hi, my name is Rick Diora, and today's lesson will consist of Brazilian brush technique, mainly samba and bossa nova. One of the most inspirational records to listen to for this style is Chicory as Light as a Feather, which fe features Aerto playing this pattern. So that pattern consists of a couple different strokes. The first one is the pop. If you watched my um, earlier brush video, I explain all these strokes in greater detail, so you might want to look at that. So the pop is done by just slapping the brush on the head with the end where the brush meets the rubber there, and then the wires at the same time. So you get kind of a conga kind of slap or rim shot. So. That's one stroke. The others are these sweeps which go between your notes, like that. So the left hand is normally doing this, and you're moving towards you and then away from you. So, so the left hand really serves to fill in the rhythms of the right hand. So alone those rhythms might be Okay, so um, studying some Brazilian percussion books would really help with this, but uh, we're not going to go into the uh, exact rhythms for this video, just the techniques. So if you take that pattern and improvise, just fill in with the left hand. Now, another way to do this is to fill in with these staccato sweeps, which are these. So, so you're filling in, again, all those rhythms, but this time you're moving back and forth. So, that kind of motion, or that's a good way to start out just doing singles quite difficult. So, so a lot, lot going on there with those fill-ins, and that really adds a lot of color to your playing. Now also you can do uh, little patterns like this for slower samba or even bossa nova, faster bossa nova. And basically that's a flutter going one, two, three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and two. And then the left hand is just playing accompanying patterns, swirl patterns. Now one of my favorite um, brush patterns is, is a batacada pattern where you're just doing the kasha pattern which is a snare drum, a Brazilian snare drum basically uh, and that's this one two three four four one two one two one two one two so there the left hand is dead stroking a double stroke like that you gotta use your bottom fingers there to catch the brush because it's not going to want to bounce and you see and there are my accents. So in, in the kasha, that would be a buzz snare drum note with the left hand. Here it's an open double. And you see I'm playing the sordo note there with my right hand. That would normally be on my floor tom. Very, very effective. Um, we're playing in back of solos or, or just an intro or anything. Uh, let's talk a little about bossa nova. Most of you know this rhythm. Um, uh, we're going to use the back of the brush for as, as a stick and um, that's your cross rim click there and normally you just in basic bossa nova pattern is or
Now you see there, I'm doing my little doubles. Again, to spice it up. And every time I hit that rim, I'm doing double. Another way to do this is to play that pattern that I played before, the flutter pattern. So that works really well too. You can also go Um, that double time pattern, which sometimes you'll do uh, in the bossa nova when you're going. So there I'm playing on top of the brush. You can also use a stick for that. And then we also have our scrapes. Almost like a Wiro pattern. So I'm going to close out by playing a little improvisation. I hope you enjoyed this, and I'll see you next time.